business. So for the married folks, for the married folks, you have got to intentionally and deliberately always extend a great deal of respect to your spouse. Praise God, you've got to intentionally and deliberately extend a great deal of respect to your spouse. Keep in mind, it's a lifelong commitment. It's a lifelong commitment. Some couples don't even care about their looks anymore. Praise God, the day after they've been married, after a couple of months, they don't care about their looks anymore. They get so comfortable. They get so familiar, you know, with their spouse. Meanwhile, that's wrong. That's a custom mistake. You've got to continue to dress nice. You've got to continue to look nice. Praise God. Keep in mind, your spouse goes outside of the house from time to time. Praise God. And he or she will see some good stuff outside. So you've got to not, don't get so familiar that you, you don't even take very good care of yourself anymore. Praise God. You see some people, you know, when they're home, they don't even take, they don't take a shower for a long time. <laughs> they don't take a shower for a long time. Some of them, you pass by them, you, you smell something strange. <laughs> something very strange, completely strange. They get you too familiar. They get you too familiar. And that's not good for you. If you get so familiar and your spouse is not kissing you anymore, <laughs> and you're saying, well, you don't kiss me anymore. Don't get too familiar. Brush your teeth on time. <laughs> Praise God, when you take a shower, put something on your armpits. <laughs> Smell nice. <laughs> <Praise God. laughs> Smell nice. Dress nice. You were an office lady before your spouse met you. <laughs> now you're turning to a village woman. <laughs> <laughs> your spouse didn't go to the village to find you. Your spouse found, found, me, he found you in an office. So what happened to that? You think you are comfortable? For those who are interested in fellowshipping with us, we have our locations in New York City, Prisco. We have another extension in Buffalo. We have another extension in Lagos, Nigeria. Please inbox me. Send me an email to apostle at johnbassi.org. Again, that's apostle at johnbassi.org. Someone will get back to you shortly. All right, for prayers, for counseling, please feel free to inbox me on Facebook or send me an email also to apostle at johnbassett.org. God bless you. Thank you so much. To make us comfortable, praise God. He just wants us to apply his wisdom. Amen. The Bible said wisdom is profitable to direct. Very important. Don't get too familiar. Praise God that you, you just walk around the house, you know, you just fart as you like. <laughs> <laughs> You, you walk around the house, fart as you like. Meanwhile, in those days, when you met your spouse, nobody knew you could fart. It was as if you never could fart. Praise God. <laughs> Praise God. It sounds so funny, but it's, it's very relevant, right? Am I preaching? Praise God. Yes. Hey, man, you've got to be decent. You've got to be decent. <laughs> Hey man, you've got to be decent. Praise God, you've got to do things that will continually you know, promote your, your relationship, something that will enhance your relationship. It's of God. I believe that word bless your life. I'd like for you to share. And number two, I'd like for you to uh, have access to some of my books. You know, I have books that would take your walk with God to the next level. I saw Jesus, so can you. Amen. This book will take your walk with God to the next level. I have books on life discovery, praise God. I have books on uh, daily, you know, daily devotionals that will help transform your lives. You know, something that you could read every day. They are all in alignment with the word of God. They will change your life. I have testimony books, you know, you know, we have many people sharing about how God has been good to them, how God has touched their lives. Amen. We, I also have a book on real estate, how to become a homeowner. You know, they, you have tons of them. I just love for you to visit Amazon. If you go on Amazon.com, praise God, and just type my name, Dr. John A. Bassey, 
you will have access to all of my books. I'm confident that your life will not remain the same again. If you want to write me, if you want to email me, you want to inbox me, please feel free to do so. What can anyone do on